The Waigani National Court has granted an injunction against the Internal Revenue Commission in distributing 10% to Central Province, 3% to Gulf and 2% to Motu Koita Assembly from inland GST paid by business houses and service providers operating in the city to the National Capital District. While welcoming the decision of the National Court and City Governor Poes Parkop called on IRC Commissioner General Sam Koim to remit GST funds from the national government's component of GST collected in the city and not from the 60% component belonging to the National Capital District. The governor maintained that NCDC has never failed to remit legal obligations to the central province. If central province is entitled to more GST raised in the city, it should not come out from the 60% inland GST that is due to the National Capital District, especially via the National Capital District Commission. It's a very clear pronouncement of the Supreme Court. <coughs> It's very explicit, very clear. But we are begging court because Mr. Cohen took it upon himself to override the Supreme Court and make a unilateral decision, ignoring the Supreme Court and its finding. And now we're finding ourselves in the court. This is the only outstanding point and that uh, needs to be resolved. And we don't have to go to court again. The governor maintained that NCDC has never failed to remit legal obligations to the central province and the Motu Koita Assembly until the end of 2020 when some funds were held back due to threats issued by Governor Robert Agarobe on social media. However, Governor Pakop revealed that NCD will not make any payments to Gulf Provincial Government as it will set a bad precedent for other city authorities and the Supreme Court has not made any order to pay the Gulf province either. Governor Pakop said NCD has the right to receive its 60% of inland GST as this is one of its main source of income for the city.